Remember one time we didn't have an idea for a vlog, yeah. so you uh, put your balls on Todd's face. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, people love that. <laughs> <laughs> that was one of my favorites. I love ideas that you're like, oh, this is not good, and then people end up liking it. Well, I like the <laughs> I like that idea a lot because it's so relatable. Because I've been people put balls on my face a lot. Really? Yeah, yeah. I mean, everyone used to do that in high school at sleepovers. You've never you've never had a good s sleepover. A good sleepover has to have one oh. person's balls on your face. Oh, I thought you meant when you were a prostitute. No, oh, nothing sorry. with me being a prostitute. I haven't had a good sleepover, I guess. Have you? Did you do sleepovers? <laughs> I guess my sleepovers were really awful. Did you do sleepovers no as a kid? In my mouth. Uh, yeah, I did sleepovers. I used to cry. Really? <laughs> yeah. You were that kid? When I was younger, yeah. Uh. I used to not like going away at all. Did you like to just get out of the house and you were eight, nine? You know what was weird when, uh, during my sleepovers? Jerking off was like a normal thing. Why the f Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> this will be my new thing, like my, my middle cam. Wait, what? When David says something that's outrageous, um, that's crazy. <laughs> who who would jerk off at a sleepover? Well, we wouldn't do it. What would happen is like we'd all be like on Pornhub, and we'd all find videos that we like, and we'd share them with each other, and then we go one by one to the bathroom. <laughs> that is really weird. I guess we didn't have Pornhub. I'm trying to think. If I think I would this have is like that. when this, we were like younger kids. We just discovered that we had penises, and we just discovered that if you touch your penis, it it makes you happy. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I mean, was I, it unspoken? Like, or no. would you be like, "All right, guys, I'm gonna go jerk off in there now"? No, it wasn't unspoken. You definitely tell the other person. I also had like a really like like I remember like, and then when you come out, does the guys go, "Hey, how'd it go"? Or like like that or no? It, you, the rest of the guys were just playing video games, and maybe like one guy would say a comment like, "Oh, was it fun?" And then everybody else would be playing video games. Like so, you wouldn't really notice. I feel like we had a like I don't know. Middle school was really like sexual, and so was like the beginning of high school. Like I, I know like like it's such a sexual place. Like all, all the kids are always fucking horny. All, all they're talking about is sex. And I don't know, like, when the first couple of people have sex, it's, like, the talk of the town. And then everybody's like, whoa, we can do sex now? We're old enough to have sex? Right. Like, I remember that's how it was. It was probably a big deal. It was, yeah, it was crazy. I never even thought about having sex. I didn't even know that was possible. It didn't really bother me when other people were having sex. I would just be like, oh. Oh, no, it never bothered me. But it, yeah. it, 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 because it never, like, seemed like something I could do. I got to shoot with Kylie Jenner this week, which was really no. fun. Real fun Came yeah. out good Congrats Thanks That's a big moment for you Why are you saying it Like you're jealous Because yeah, I am <laughs> <laughs> um, No it was great We got to uh, Yeah we, we It was great Oh my god It was so much fun Yeah I don't it know Came out great I, Literally I, I say this But I don't know why I'm always so surprised <laughs> When I hang out with a celebrity I'm Every time I'm like Why is it Why am I surprised David But I'm like Oh she was great Like she was so nice Right And I was and I, I don't know why you're surprised when a celebrity is normal. Is normal. Sorry, mm -hmm. that's what I'm trying to say. I couldn't get it out. Stars, they're just like us, yeah. as us weekly would so say. We we were filming this we were filming this bit where we were surprising people um with Kylie and then we got hungry, so we went to go eat. And we went to go sit at like a table just in like a ra random like bar. Um and there's a bunch of people around and it's so crazy. We walked into like the first restaurant and everybody's head turned. Oh my god, it was sure. like yeah, it was crazy. Everybody's head turned. So then we walked out. We went to another one. We got a burger somewhere else. And we were sitting down. And it's crazy. No one walked up to us and asked for a picture. Because it was like, they were like almost like scared. Like when me and you sit down, mm. like people walk up to us because they don't care that we're fucking eating. Because, you know, no. we're, we're just, but it's like, it was so different with Kylie. Interesting. There was like this level of like, oh my God, she's Kylie. We gotta, we gotta fuck off. Like yeah. we can't come up to her. But like <laughs> with us, funny. it's like. We're people's pals, so people show up to our fucking house <laughs> and knock on our door 50 times or, you know, yeah. grab us in public or whatever. Um, so it was just so interesting seeing that. <laughs> so interesting seeing, like, being respected. <laughs> <laughs> when someone's at your house and they're like, listen, oh my God, I, it's, people have your address. It's the worst. And I just wanted to let you know. Dude, it's the worst when someone comes up to my house. Like, the other day I went on a run. I know it's crazy. I went on a run and this girl comes right by me and, like, right outside my garage. And she goes, can I have a picture with you? And, I, and I'm like running by her. I'm like, I'm sorry, I can't. Not in front of my house. Like, I didn't even stop. Right. I was like, I got, I got to go. And her mom yells. And her mom goes, get in the car. We'll follow him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and I go, no, no, guys, I can't do anything in my neighborhood. And like, they just don't understand it. It's always parents driving their kids here. Sure. Which is so insane to me. Yeah, I'd like probably if, do it. Too. You, you would do it too? Yeah. Probably take you drive your kids here, and that that already makes me <laughs> fucking insane. When your when your own kids show up at my door, I would go, "What the fuck are you guys doing here?" 
Uh, yeah. Um, Charlie never wants to come in. Yeah. Wyatt always wants to come in. I heard they've been wor- they've been voting for me for the Kids Choice. They Awards. have been voting for. I, last night I was with them. We were playing music. I was watching them. Yeah, I'm know. nominated for Kids Choice Award, which is thank you guys. Thanks for that. But yeah, go. Yeah, and Wyatt was like, I just want to let you know that uh, um, I voted uh, seven times for David. Oh no like way! That. And I was like. I didn't even ask him to. I thought that was so nice. Yeah, that is really nice. Yeah. My mom makes all my siblings vote every day individually. They do? Yeah. How is that? How is um, talking to your, seeing your siblings? It's, it's in interesting. Chicago. It's they're so, so int- big now. They're, they're fucking huge. I know. They're, they're adults. It's so crazy because like, the last like, memories I have with my siblings are like them barely knowing how to form sentences, or at yeah. least in my head. Like They were still like... Like they still didn't speak much, but now they're like actual human beings that can function on their own. You know what I mean? Like they can go to like the mall by themselves. I can have yeah. any kind of conversation I want with them, which is really interesting. Um, they were really excited to meet Jeff. Yeah, they were really excited to meet Jeff. Um, I made sure that didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> One time I was on a flight to uh, Hawaii. I was going to visit my ex, my ex-wife. She was working in Hawaii. She was doing like a show for ABC. And uh, so I had nothing to do. I didn't have a job or anything. Just to say, bring the kids to Hawaii because I'm going to be here for like three weeks. Who paid for that? Uh, we did. I mean, the, the production didn't pay for it. Oh. Yeah, three tickets to Hawaii. She already had a Oh, room. when you're married, is it one credit card, one bank account, everything? Yeah. Get the fuck out. Yeah. You better, <laughs> wa- you better watch out when you get married. You're going to have to give all your money. Well, I'm gonna marry. I'm gonna. I'm gonna marry rich now that you told me this. <laughs> I can just use anybody. Kylie's taken. I can just use anybody's <laughs> money. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, I see what you're saying. I get it. You're going to use someone else's money and not tell them that you have your money. I'm cheap, yeah. Offshore account. I get it. Offshore account. Mm-hmm. Oh, so, okay. Bank account in the Caymans. I did not know that. That is Okay, that's really interesting. So your money combines. Wow, yeah, your man, money, just, yeah. I don't know why I'm just finding this out. Because <laughs> uh, I thought you still had two separate bank accounts. <laughs> no, she pays me on salary. What do you think? <laughs> okay, so, yeah. So you took money out. I love how that wasn't the interesting part of the story. I didn't take any money out. We no. just bought some you tickets bought on a credit card. Right. Are you an alien? <laughs> <laughs> Where are you from? Okay, go, go. So anyways, so this is like during a time when I like wasn't too happy with myself. Sure. You know what I mean? I mean, I what, love my kid. What, what, what time What's was changed? this? Yesterday? <laughs> <laughs> I last, wasn't too happy with myself. Last week. I wasn't too happy with my place in life. Yeah. And so she's like, you know, bring the kids. I want to see them. And she's like, yeah, I understand. So she's doing this big show for ABC, a submarine show with all these sets in Hawaii. And the kids are very excited to see it. Submarine show? Yeah. What fucking show was it called? Um, I don't know. Andre Brower was in it. It was called... Scott Foley, not Scott Foley, Scott. Uh, Jace, what was the show called? I've only seen one show the entire season on ABC. This was seven years ago. What was the show called, Jason? I don't remember. Uh, it was called, uh, I make a call Marnie if you want. It was called like the SS Boner or something. Or It, it was called Last Resort. It was Last Resort. Last Resort. Are you fucking serious? Yeah, why? I watched that show in its entirety. You did? I loved that show. Like, <laughs> that's so crazy. I watched it on my ABC app. I watched literally the entire, and they did, never made another season. No, it got canceled. Yeah. Oh my God, Marty will love you. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, did you she, watch her new show and love it? She, <laughs> she worked on Last Resort? Yeah, she's executive producer. Are you serious? Yeah. Your ex-wife worked on a show that, like, I, dude, I've I've literally only watched like The Bachelor, Last Resort, and this other movie where this woman got kidnapped. I, I, I That's don't, all. Yeah, you're not a big TV watcher. No, not at all. No. Like for dramas, I'm talking about like dramas. Check out SWAT on CBS. Maybe you like that too. <laughs> that is crazy. I love how you just said some some submarine show in Hawaii, and I go, what? <laughs> oh, that's fucking crazy. It's yeah, I, I I completely watched that show. I, I got so pissed when it didn't get renewed because I remember. Oh yeah, that's crazy. Okay, what's what was your it story? about? It was like a nuclear situation. Yeah, yeah they, they they were all like, yeah, they, <laughs> Jason. Did you say submarine show? <laughs> and I was like, is it fucking with Last me? resort. That is fucking insane. Okay, go. Sorry. Well, anyway, so I get on a plane to Hawaii. Yeah. These kids are really young. They're like, I don't know, six and three. Yeah. Right? So that, that's tough. That's tough. You, you got to be on an airplane with them for five hours. Keep them occupied. Oh, six and three? Yeah. It's a lot of work. Was Charlie already a smart ass? Uh, no, she was real sweet then. Oh, she's sweet. Real sweet. But <laughs> so anyways, I'm sitting there on the plane. 
and I got the two kids, and I'm like, here you go. I'm putting Cheerios out. I'm putting crayons out. I'm like, well, I'm like, I don't want to watch a movie. My headphones don't work. You know, just regular kid stuff. And I'm working. I'm working hard to try to – and – you got to keep them quiet because then people give you dirty looks. That's the worst. It's yeah. the worst. Oh, you ever have a baby on a plane? If you're the person with the baby? Oh, no, my I, God. I feel, ba- I feel so bad for those people. Oh, one time Wyatt took a dump right in the aisle. You're <gasps> fucking k- yeah. kidding. Yeah. I mean, he was a baby. So, like, the diaper, like, wasn't on properly and just, like, right in the aisle. Your son took a shit in the middle of, a, of the airplane? Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. My dog took a shit at a really nice hotel in the lobby once. What happened? They kicked us out. <laughs> Not just the dog? Yeah, they're like, you can't stay here. They were so mad. What they're, hotel? Surf and Sand. Oh, wow. Yeah. Every time I go, I'm going to drive by there. I always. <laughs> they give you dirty looks. Yeah. That's the fucking guy. Wait, your son took a middle, uh, your, your son took a, a little bathroom break in the middle of the bathroom, of the airplane? Yeah, he was literally a baby. Oh, okay. So it just like squirted what did out pe- everywhere. What did people say? Oh my God, they must have lost their mind. Yeah, it was, it was so ridiculous. No, people have no sympathy for people with babies and I fucking hate that. It was so ridiculous and awful that they just, they just let it go. I mean, sometimes you get nice people who are like, understand, it's a baby. There's nothing you can do. Oh, these people weren't understanding? Uh, that time it was. Anyways, I'm on the plane. I'm sitting there. There's a seat next to me. This woman brings the kid back to me. And she goes, hi. She goes, this is Marshall. Um, I see you have children. I'm going to put him right here with you. Like that. Get the fuck out. I go, <laughs> excuse me? <laughs> And he, this, he's four. He's four years old. And she's like, yes. She's like, he'll be, he'll be better back here with the other children. And I was like, oh my God. I was like, no, no. Oh, I know what it was. Her sister was sitting next to me at first. So they swapped. They, she's like, I'm gonna, I'm, the sister's going to come sit with me. Oh, wow. And I was like, that is bold. I was like, I don't want to take care of another child. He seems lovely. I don't want to take care of another. I'm already taking care of two. Back here, and she's just like, she's like, you know, I, 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 he'll, he'll be fine. He'll be fine. I am pissed. Five hours with this kid, and he's, you know, he's a good kid. And so eventually, he, he needs so much, so much tending to. My juice, my this, my Marshall. That. Yeah, Marshall. Oh, you were actually like helping this kid oh, out. Oh, I took care of him for five hours. I, I was, I was absolutely livid. Oh, I would have just been like, fuck you, get out of here. I, I, but there was nothing I could do. There was nothing I could do. And I'm looking at the adults up front. They're drinking. They're laughing. They're having fun. I am steaming. I am steaming. And so the, into the, like the third or fourth hour, it's like whatever. I, they, I tame these kids. I do a great job. They're laughing. They're having a great time. Sure. And, but I'm still pissed. I'm still seething. Anyways, get off the flight. The mom comes back. She comes back and she goes, um, she goes thank you so much for watching him. She goes... His father passed away three days ago. Oh, wow. Like that. So it shows you, don't be a dick. (laughs) Holy fuck. Yeah. What did you say when she told you that? I I was crushed. I was like, oh. I was like, that's terrible. She goes, yeah. Come on, Marshall. (laughs) (laughs) My God. Yeah. And then I went to... See Last Resort. Yeah! <laughs> the story's great! <laughs> the I story. mean, it sucks a kid died. <laughs> the story is everything I need. 